Hey guys, it's Captain Babyface, and welcome to Season 1, Episode 4 of my Suncraft series. Oh my god, it's a wolf! He's got company. <laughs> <laughs> so, in this episode, just like I said I was going to do in Episode 2, I actually said that Episode 3 was going to be me building and working on my mountain base. That's going to be this episode, since the last episode was a prank episode. Um, I want to get a lot of work done on it today so I'm going to be building and like most of it's gonna be building off a of camera and then I'll come back and I'll update you guys basically what I'm gonna do is you can see how I built this like archway with the stone bricks I'm gonna dig this one up and this is like these pillars I guess you can call them pillars that we have here this is gonna go up and this is gonna be another archway um, just like this one only a lot bigger and then there are going to be like some windows in the walls so that you can see in the base. And then we're going to dig this out. Maybe I'll buy some TNT for that because I think somebody on the server um, sells TNT. But we're going to dig that out, load that up. <laughs> um, I don't know, one of them. If I buy TNT, I'll definitely do that on camera because that's always fun to watch. But that's what it's going to be this episode. So I'm going to start building and I will be back with my first update in like two seconds for you guys. But probably a little while for me. Welcome back everybody. I dug out uh, as much as I'm going to dig out right here. Now what I just have to do is... I need some blocks. Good, I still got a stack of dirt. I use dirt to do the scaffolding up here. Um, what I'm going to do now is I just have to take all of this stone. Let's make like four stacks of stone bricks. You know what, I actually need to go make some stairs. Hold on a second. <laughs> Okay, I'm back, and I made some stairs, so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to do this thing again, and it's just going to be a bigger scale, so I just want to... Let's get some dirt. I'm going to build up here, like so, on both sides of here, and we're going to do like a thing in the corner, the top corners with the stairs again, so that it looks like it's... um. You know, just the same kind of pattern as we did down there. Um, I'm going to do this. We'll do this. There we go. So now we'll just place this like this. And back here, we'll place these. Go like that. I need to build out to the side so that I can actually reach up here. Okay. Kind of like this. Oh, I need to go in do not disturb mode. Okay, sorry about that. Um, then we'll just go like this. I hope that looks good. We'll check it in a second, but um, you know what? I'm gonna want stone slabs actually. I think to connect these. These stone slabs. You know, I think I'm just gonna do a whole block of stone bricks. Um, we'll cut this all out, both sides. So yeah, that's what's gonna happen on the other side too. I'm gonna finish that up, and then I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Uh, I did that, and I actually changed it down here a little bit. There were um, stairs continuing this pattern right here and I broke them and replaced them with um, full blocks so that it kind of looks more like that because uh, this is kind of like more square I guess um, and that was kind of pointed and this one is more squared off at the top so um, I'm th I don't know if the like the stone canvas we'll call, it, we'll, we'll call this a canvas around it um, I don't know if I'm gonna change that with um, the stone to stone brick or if I'll do like a pattern in it or something to make it look a little better or if maybe I'll bring it out and try to build around it but this is all going to change um this outside look that we've got going right now is probably not going to stay the same but what I want to do now is we're going to first place this fix this because it's bothering me okay um, but I'm just gonna build, or I'm gonna dig this. It's gonna 
be a relatively big room. It's going to take me a while to dig, so that's obviously going to be done off camera because I don't want to bore you guys to death. But I'm going to begin digging this um, big room. I don't know how big it's going to be. I don't exactly know the dimensions that I'm going to do for it. I'm kind of just going to um, just dig. Just going to dig. See where it takes me. It'll probably end up being a big square room. A rectangle room. But that uh, will change as that's not going to look good when it's like that. It's... Um, so I'm just going to build the square, and then once I have it, or take the square, and then once I have it all dug out, then we can start to make, um, like, make the room look a little bit differently. I want this to be a big room, because what I kind of imagine is I imagine, like, water flowing and greenery and stones, um, on the sides of this leading to a entrance, like that looks like this straight ahead, like, I don't know, 20 or 30 blocks out, maybe more than that, that leads into, like, a big bridge over, like, a big room with nothing under it, maybe lava under it. It'll be cool. It'll be a big project, too. So that's what I got planned. I'm going to start digging on that, and then I'll be back with an update. Hey you guys, welcome back. I am going to the spawn right now because I thought somebody mentioned that they sold TNT at their shop. So I'm going to look for that place that sells TNT. Also, I kind of just want to show you guys the spawn. I haven't really showed the spawn. It's a very, very nice spawn. I think it looks great. Um, like, even when there's not buildings, it's just they've done so much with the landscape. It looks awesome, and I love it. Um, this is the shop, I think, that sells... TNT. It's called War's Big Boom Boom Emporium. He sells fireworks. He might sell some TNT also. Let's go check. Um, request your own type of firework in this book. Payment chest. Not sure what you like. Ask us to test some for free. That is obnoxious the way he has the caps. Um, okay, 6 TNT, 6 diamonds, or 12 iron for TNT. Oh, okay. So it's probably 12 iron for 8 of them. Which means I have... There's eight TNT right there. Eight TNT right there. So we got 16. Now we got 24 TNT. Uh, 24 plus 8. Oh, jeez. I am not in math mode. This is two, 32. And then... 30 or 40, so I can get 40 of them for a stack. I'm just gonna toss that in there, and we're gonna take five of these things. One, two, three, four, five! Leave a little check mark right in the middle for him. We got some TNT, this is gonna be fun. Expansion now open, let's see what he's got. You may mix and match so you don't have. so you don't have one color and one effect. Prices will be the same for the amount. Enjoy. He's got a nice little shop here. Let's see what else Mana's got to offer. I actually saw <laughs> a lot of it today. Uh, there's a pretty funny part over here. Um, looks like this is now open to everything shop. Looks like it's it's got everything. <laughs> uh, modern building type looks really nice. I don't think there's anything in it yet. Over here, I don't know what this is. What is this? Creeper Man Repair Shop. Okay. Payment chest, one iron ingot for two stacks. Oh, okay, you can just buy dirt, which is useful. Just if you want to, like, terraform, you don't have to, you know, chunk out a mountain. This is their UHC monument. You might have already noticed it. I'll give you a couple seconds to notice it if you haven't yet. Yes, they are all indeed penis, <laughs> penis-like. Um, obviously, that's they're all players of, from the server. I don't know who either of these people are. I know that this is Penguin Queen, who is the owner of the server, and they all resemble penises. So there you go. Just gotta eat up. I've only got watermelon, so I guess I could have some steak. I've got a bunch of cows back at the at the base. Okay, on to the next place in the tour. Ah, yes, I couldn't forget to show you guys this. Um, there's the command block used here. Um, 
Oh shit, those break instantly. I did not know that. Obviously, command blocks are not vanilla. However, I'm okay with it because it doesn't like impede the vanilla gameplay. It doesn't change anything um, vanilla. It, it keeps the game is still vanilla with these command blocks. We use some com command blocks on the server, but it's only to keep some mini games running. Um, Otherwise, they wouldn't be able to. But you hit this thing, it shoots you way up into the air. You jump down on these slime blocks. And you go up here. Um, and then up here, more command blocks. But it's just to pick the color of your name. Like, you can be on teams. You can rename the teams that don't have any team names, I think. Um, so, if you wanted to make, like, a prank team or something, you could all be like, hey, let's go team Dark Aqua. And we can all be Dark Aqua together. So. Whoop. Okay, so now, next on the tour, I don't know if I've shown Town Hall yet. I think I've shown Town Hall. It's pretty much empty inside. It looks like a bong. Hmm. Oh, I believe this is... Wait, what is this? Our... <laughs> it's, a, it's a stripper pole. Okay, forgot about that. Um, This is a banner shop. You can go in here. I like the colors in this place, by the way. All these blocks go really well together. Pre-made banner room. Also, we can modify a banner. Oh, this guy is, uh, he joined the server today. He's on earlier. Um, yeah, he just joined today. Um, next on the tour. This is the actual place that you spawn in. Right here. Spawn on the top of here. I think it looks great. I'm actually intimidated to build on the server because everybody is such a good builder and I am not so much. I'm a, I wouldn't say I'm a bad builder, I just don't think I'm as good as everybody else on this server, so it's a little intimidating building something. Hey, there's cake. This is a church, just a small little chapel thing. There is an arranged marriage <laughs> that is going to happen on the server, I believe it's between Rocker and Sten. But that's cake, he's the new person to join today. And then over here, I don't know if I've shown this yet, this is Minigame Land. It's just called Minigame Land, there isn't a name for it other than that yet. I think they plan on naming it, but I'm just going to show this to you really quickly. That is King of the Ladder Ladder. Um, there's some command blocks used in there just for barrier blocks at the bottom so that you can... Um, like see into the void without falling in. Very cool KOTL setup. I love it very much. This is uh, generic bees. Uh, snowfall. What you do is there's two um, blocks of snow, and under that is lava. What you do is you have pumpkins and you place them, and it's like spleef because when you place one, it's going to make a, a snow golem, and then it falls into the lava and dies. So the block just disappears, and you try to make everybody fall in. This is Rooster Teeth King. Basically, you have one person who is the king, and everybody else has to do what the king says. And whoever completes the task, like when you complete a task that the king says to do, you get a gold block in which you put on your obsidian block, and then whoever gets four of them wins and is the king for the next round. We haven't played that yet, but I'm really looking forward to it. It sounds really fun. <laughs> well, that is pretty much it with the spawn, I think. I'm going to head back to the mountain base right now and show you what I've got done with that, and then we're going to blow up a bunch of stuff <laughs> instead of me having to dig it out. So I'll see you there. Hey, you guys, we're back at the base right now, and I'm about to show you all the digging I've got done, but um, I want to show you <laughs> show you this cute little baby tree. It's It's supposed to be a big tree, but it's just a little one. It kind of turned out weird. It's so cute. Unlike this one, it turned out beautiful. I was making big trees, and the way I do that is I just, um... Well, I'll show you one, how you do it. Um, let me go get some bone meal. This is a little trick that b O taught me. We need some more bone meal, so let's get this. Bones. Awesome. And, because I like to have a lot of trees around my house, I like to wait until after... I've got like my building out here done to actually put the trees down, but I was sick of not having trees surrounding me, so I put some down. You go six blocks up, you take torches, and you put torches on each one of these right next to a sapling. Just real quick. 
And then what you do, this doesn't work 100% of the time, because sometimes you get messed up baby dwarf trees. Um, but usually it does, you just spam it till it grows. It'll be a big one usually. Come on. Come on, there you go, see? Beautiful tree, it's huge, I love it. I love big trees. This is the kind of thing you can expect to be outside of here all the time once I have my build done. And these cows are so loud right now, you guys need to calm down. Let's feed them real quick. Let's, uh, let's go around and I'll walk on the fences. Come on, come on. Oh, I fell in. Oh well. I need to kill them soon. But that's okay. They're gonna start glitching through the walls or something. Okay, so now I hope you guys are ready to see some explosions, possibly some lag. <laughs> but let's get our flint steel and our TNT that we just bought. Um, I've got this dug out some, but I don't want to dig anymore. I would much rather use TNT because TNT is so much more fun. This is a fact. Let us put a TNT right here. Um, I don't really know good TNT patterns to do. Hopefully that's not too far away. That'll work right there. Oh, I didn't mean to break you. Sorry, Mr. TNT. Please forgive me. So we'll just do a pattern like this, I guess. Hopefully they all set each other off. Let's just, let's light this real quick and see what happens. Oh, this is awesome. I love TNT. Awesome! <laughs> Love TNT. Uh, I need some torches. Let's just light this up a little bit. It's not going to be a perfect explosion. I will clean it up later, but we're just going to keep blowing stuff up. TNT right there. And then we'll put one... Goes back one more, does it not? I don't know why I'm so OCD about them being perfectly placed. They're gonna get blown up anyway, but... Okay. I don't want to place another one too far over. Let's just put one, like, right here. That should get blown too. Eee! Run away! We gotta see the explosion, though. Well, that was lame. Okay, let us set up more TNT for a big TNT explosion. Okay, I've got uh, four rows back placed. Now it's gonna all blow up! Woo! <laughs> explosions! Awesome, I love explosions. So, I think we're getting to the... Um, about the time limit on the episode. Don't want it to be too long. It's been a pretty productive episode, I think. Um, bought some TNT. We blew up this. We finished um, this archway thing. And I've done a lot of work on like the outside of the base itself. Uh, that was mainly off camera, but it got done. Been a pretty productive episode. I think I'm gonna end it here. So make sure that you guys like or dislike it, but do one of them. Don't just not like it or dislike it. Be sure to leave a comment in the description. Tell me something that you want me to do, just tell me how your day was, tell me something. Tell me if you liked the video, or if you disliked it, and why you liked it, or disliked it. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye guys!